Hello lovelies, I have a couple of questions that I gathered a couple of uh, days ago. The first one that I am going to look at is a very long one about, um, let's see, uh, Hugh Crosswinner, uh, the current Duke of Westminster. Um, um, it's a request for his life in general, how is it his life doing right now, as well as his love life. So uh, for this, I would do a slightly bigger spread, um, uh, simply because I could not find much of anything about this person on the internet. Mm from the gossip side so I will do a, a slightly bigger spread to see basically what the cards want to show me uh, so let's go with this um, I already requested for permission for a reading for his higher good um, I would say that there is a a person in his life that will be that has a very nice energy um, so let's see what that is um, okay I have these cards open so, all right uh, so yeah <laughs> the person with the nice energy uh, that's that's the card that is presenting himself mm, his money uh, what is focused on his family so there is some some not good news about his family um, what he likes to do his work basically the work is what he's public you can find about him publicly uh, the love uh, yeah, it's an interesting card. And what's gonna happen in his life? What well, he needs to find out where his ambitions are at. And some his friends. Uh, what he needs to cut loose from his life and that's where I will stay at right now I will put uh, just a few more cards here just to see what that situation is at uh, righty so I have quite a lot of cards coming out and uh, let's see, let's see what we have here. Hmm. Okay. Um, first of all, the question about love um, is not a far-fetched one. I'll start with his friends um, or the people he surrounds himself with. Uh, there's something in his way of thinking that he needs to change. He's uh, actually right now, he shows at a stage where things are changing for him. So change is not a bad thing. He needs to start thinking, um, um, uh, start thinking differently. Like, for example, if until now he was the one thinking that, oh, uh, people are there just to use me. Um, he needs to let that go, uh, let that thought go. Uh, and especially for the, because of this card, he needs to let go that people are in his life or coming to his life only to use him. Um, there is now and there will be a, 
especially in when it comes to his you know love project uh there is a loving uh, support in his life and it's from women uh one in particular um uh, simply because when I was um, just meditating on, you know, what, what, what's the message. Um, uh, and um, I saw I saw a, a woman. May not necessarily be a, let's say, a woman that's physically in his life or will be in his life. But more like um, an angel in, in, uh, in female form, you know. Telling to his mom, and I think that this woman here uh, is his mom that's showing up. Uh, telling to his mom that you know she she raised a fine young man. That was that were the uh, the words um, of this you know female energy. Again, I'm not going to venture to say oh this is uh, uh, a, a woman in his life. Although if even if there isn't one, there will be soon. You know the woman uh, but um, uh, definitely that 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 reading uh, the, the only permission that uh, reason that I had permission to do this reading is because of that um, you know loving motherly nature as a reassurance to her that everything will be okay with, with her son uh, he needs to uh, you know in, in, in terms of his socium he needs to change uh, the way he's um, he's seeing things, the, the way that he's perceiving people. There are people out there, whether they have means or do not have any means, that are not there to get him. He does not have to uh, stick to his guns, stick to his you know finances. Um, um, thinking that um, people want to want to t take advantage of him so I think that's the the erroneous thought that he needs to let go of um, of course of course with 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 his um, um, with his uh, let's say stance in life uh, there is a, um, uh, there is, um, uh, how can I say, um, there is, a, uh, of course, a possibility that, you know, you, you are taken advantage of. Uh, and lately we had in the news a lot of uh, situations where, you know, people just um, leave off the idea of, you know, being fake popular or... Um, you know, living off other people's means or things like that. Uh, even though this is part of the reality, there is a different part of reality. And um, um, I apologize for taking, uh, giving this advice. <laughs> I'm certainly the last person who will be defending the moms, but he, with mom on his side, he, he will do okay. Um so uh, let's see. Um, there's two things that uh, just uh, are um, uh, jumping off of this reading for me of these cards. Um, not 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 there to look at these cards yet. I hope you can see them all. But you know, even if you don't, that's that's still not not important. Um, the first thing is um, uh, there is a life project coming up for him, and that's uh, that's a love project. Um, I think it will be a successful. I think it will be a successful. Uh, he again, um, a lot of things do not come to me in detail. Uh, simply because um, again it feels like that this this entire reading is is manifesting as a reassurance to his mom that everything will be okay and maybe give her 
to give him some some um, let's say practical advice. Uh, but whatever the uh, the life project when it comes to love is, it will be a success. Um, it will be a success, and and I'll get get to to these cards because you know they they're not bad cards. Let's say, let's put it this way. Um, uh, let me see. Let me see. Um, so. Uh, I'll get to the to the hidden parts here. Mm. What I what I'm seeing is that um, this is clearly the broken heart. Um, he's still nursing a. Um, he's still um, um, in his heart. In his life, maybe he moved on and. A lot of us do that. We we move on. We even you know go to a different relationship or even get married, and we're still hung up on that last relationship. Um, uh, there is no past woman from his life coming up. This is all you know future and what he wants for the future. He would like to have a woman who she doesn't have to be rich, but she. You know, it will be nice that she's not, uh, um, let's say, fixated or depending on or wanting to depend on other, on others. Uh, he will, and that's the advice for him. He will and he should uh, be um, um, not spending money, but. Um, uh, find what's meaningful for her, uh, what uh, would be, what she would uh, find nice, and share it with her, with that woman. Um, simply because um, uh, things are not about. Um, hmm. That, oh, let me see. Uh, he is. Uh, I'll say it in a different way. He's currently focused on either having a woman or finding a woman. I'll ask after that if there is already somebody in his life. But, you know, right now it... You you would be surprised at uh, how much uh, you, you, you can get from the cards even with um, little to no information at all. And even, you know, you can get a lot of from past lives as well. So... He is hoping, you know, um, wh wh whoever was that broke his heart, he's hoping the next one is not with him. Uh, it, and, and that he's hoping that the next woman in his life uh, is a a woman who is a, um, he's okay with with finances. He's she, that she's not craving status. She's not craving um, uh, power. She's not craving uh, money or uh, nice things to be bought to her or gifted to her or nice trips to be gifted to her. Uh, maybe somebody who can who can afford, you know, to a certain extent all of that, and feels okay in her in her life. She is a woman who's put together. What his surprise will be is that that will be a a woman who is very um, in touch with her uh, femininity. So what he needs to look for, and maybe that's that's connected to the uh, to the tower card. He needs to look for a a femininity. How would that look like? Um, he would not take uh, the the advice of his mom, so he he's he's on his own. He needs to he needs to recognize what femininity looks like. Um, and again, uh, a, a feminine woman could be in uh, you know uh, uh, boots and uh, and pants and still you know be very um, 
uh, not sexy, overly sexy, but feminine. You know, feminine is the word he needs to look for. Uh, he's he's right now um, in a not uh, not in not not a nice uh, situation. Uh, I'm going to put all those um, uh, sword cards together. Um, he is um, he wants to withdraw. He wants to uh, he, he's with first of all he's withdrawn from. Um, um uh let's say from uh um a nonsense doing stupid stuff just for fun the fun of it and things like that things are very very serious for him he feels like he's like trapped in this uh um, in this life of his and there there's a lot of sorrow sorrow of uh um n not like sorrow in uh, missing out on things but sorrow of you know yeah, life turned out this way. I wouldn't change it because that's how fate is. But, you know, if I could choose, I would choose this. I would choose the love. Um, and there, there is there's two things. Um, in, two things that he needs to... Uh, and, and these are really messages for him. Uh, two things that he needs to focus on. The first thing is, whatever... Um, renovations and these are house renovations that he's involved in somehow whatever renovations he's doing he needs to do them he needs to even if he hates it even if he hates it even if there's a lot of um um how can i say a lot of um uh, quarrels misunderstandings not being on the same page fights and him just wanting to get out of it all whatever renovation specifically house renovation he's involved in he needs to fix that he needs to finish that project because the ace of ace of hearts the love the new love that's a new person in his his life um a, a, a woman who is put together a woman who um who feels good in he in in her skin? Who feels that uh, she's enough just the way she is? A woman who is feminine, and he needs to uh, start recognizing feminine, not sexy, not uh, uh, not um, a uh, looking expensive or you know being dressed expensively whatever it is he needs to start recognizing what feminine is um and um uh, the new love will come and the, the uh, again an, an energy is blocked towards this uh you know good thing that is in in his life um the energy is blocked until uh blocked until he finishes that renovation project that he's involved in that may not be his house it could be someone else's house whatever whatever again it's specifically regarding a house he needs to finish that um he needs to um he wants some um uh, um, and this is really specifically about him and his soulmate. Okay, he he's interested in more. Um, uh, I I think it's him. Let me see. No, no, it's her. It's her. So she wants his soulmate wants more excitement, more going out, more you know. Uh, yeah more excitement more fun stuff to do he's not there yet yeah he's not there uh but it will be a new love new person in his life and he needs to be uh he needs to be vigilant that's the word that comes to me vigilant now about his life about his love life uh that's a you know pretty neat midi reading let me see if i'm how much time did I talk? I hope it's not too much. Oh my god, I need to finish soon. But uh, So, um, I'll do this and then I'll ask if there's already somebody in his life or as it feels like it will be somebody 
that will come to his life. Um, now, he needs to be prepared that uh, this with this person, uh, it, um, they might end up as a family. That's a family card. Being well off and again being, you know, um, the, uh, the full package. And the full package is really a man and a woman in love with their kids. Um, one kid and two dogs. <laughs> Um, this is the uh, very nice um, um, grounded male energy. Male energy, uh, like in usually, it comes as a um, a herald of marriage proposal. Um, in this case, it could be that um, because that's him. That's him showing up as a you know a young man who is on a path, on a mission to to build the family of his dreams with the love, with the love. Um, and um, Ed, these are not that, uh, let's say, loving um, um, cards uh, when it comes to love life. He's, he's, he's not... <sighs> Maybe that has something to do with the tower. So let me see. The hanged man is the, the hidden, another hidden key card. Um, it, it has something to do with, uh, with him not, uh, not being all love, you know, opening his heart and, you know, um, being out there for, for that uh, special someone. Um, he has a very nice um, uh, patriarchal energy. Traditional, uh, that's the word traditional that comes to, to mind. Uh, that's, uh, um, he, he has, yeah, he has a very, very nice, he's ready to start that life project. Uh, and there will be a surprise, surprise about this life project. Um, maybe keep an open mind. And again, uh, the key here is really uh, when he finds that woman, uh, or if he has found her yet already, he needs to ask if uh, she, uh, he needs to start recognizing femininity. Where is femininity and how does it look like? Uh, and not everyone is out there to be, you know, um, he doesn't have to protect himself all the time. Although it's a good advice to keep protecting himself. Uh, and again, that's what the cards say for, for you know, maybe it's a good thing to uh, to not always be on guard. Now, let's see now if he... Uh, if he already has somebody in his life, if he already has that somebody in his life, that soulmate, and um, it is a no, it is a no. Uh, but again, you know, uh, the divine, the, the divine is already working on that, so no, no need to, you know, whenever we have the. Uh, this card, it, it, it really is, it really is about um, getting, getting connected, getting connected, uh, but like a divine connection. So uh, he need, he needs to not worry. Um, the the moment, the moment he, uh, the mo uh, so he, he's confused. First of all, he's very confused right now. Even though the archangels are already, already there to to help him, um, he in order for him to transform for from a a man who is you know yeah, um, let's say entrenched into into the material world, into a man who is. Uh, who is soaking in love yeah uh, in order for this transformation to happen uh, the divine will swoop in 
so he, I think here, even though, okay, um, here's the thing about, a, let's say, predictions. Um, and when it comes to predictions, uh, it, it, when, you, when you hear that something is going to come to you, do not sit at home and wait uh, on the couch saying, oh, it's going to come to me in so-and-so time. And that's, that card is probably sooner than you expected. Uh, but rather, do you work? So, uh, yes, he is, you know, he doesn't really know what the people in his life are. Most likely, it will be somebody new that he meets or wh whatever. Um the divine is helping already and he will go into that uh, transformation. He will go into that opening of heart. Um, but again, right now he has other things to finish. Things that are anchoring him into uh, to the material, to the problems, to the finances that he, he needs to finish that. And once, once that current project is finished, uh, he, uh, you know, th things will start changing because we'll, he'll be more free to, um, to experience um, love. So that's for let's say, again, uh, Hugh Crosswinner. <laughs>